Listen, I need you to hear what I'm about to say clearly, but I want you to act on what I'm about to say immediately. And that is don't allow the dictionary of your dilemma to define who you are just because it documents what you've done. I know you missed it. I said, don't allow the dictionary of your dilemma to define who you are just because it documents what you've done. And it takes nothing away from what you've done in your past. But whatever it is that you've done in your past, it doesn't have to define who you are in your present because you are not what you've done. You did it, but you don't have to be it because you figured out a way to navigate through it and ultimately come out of it. And I know there are some people right now in your life that are trying to rewrite the dictionary of your dilemma because they may understand that the purpose of a dictionary is to take words and associate those words with definitions and descriptions that may define who you are just because they have details on what you've done. But I want you to know that you're more than a conqueror. You are literally the head and not the tail. You are above and not beneath. You are the lender and not the borrower. And no matter what it is that you've done in your past, it doesn't have to define who you are in your present.